Europe's renewed interest in Africa has sparked intrigue and debate, raising questions about the motivations and implications of this surge. In this exploration, we delve into the multifaceted reasons behind why Europe is once again turning its attention towards Africa, examining economic, geopolitical, and developmental factors that are reshaping this relationship. Welcome back to our channel, where we explore captivating topics and dive into insightful discussions. In today's video, we explore the intriguing phenomenon of why Europe is once again turning its attention towards Africa. We delve into the factors driving this renewed interest and analyze its potential implications. If you're curious about the evolving dynamics between Europe and Africa and want to stay informed, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell, so you never miss any of our engaging content. Let's jump right. The legacy of colonialism left enduring imprints on the continent, shaping economic structures and political dynamics. Now, as Europe seeks to re-engage with Africa, there is a recognition that a more collaborative and mutually beneficial approach is necessary, moving beyond the exploitative practices of the past. One of the driving forces behind Europe's renewed interest in Africa is the continent's vast economic potential. With a youthful population, abundant natural resources, and growing consumer markets, Africa is increasingly viewed as a strategic investment destination. European countries, facing sluggish economic growth at home, see Africa as a source of new markets, investment opportunities, and avenues for diversification. European nations are actively seeking to strengthen trade relations and establish economic partnerships with African countries. The African Continental Free Trade Area, which aims to create the world's largest free trade area, has further incentivized European nations to position themselves strategically within this evolving economic landscape. Bilateral and multilateral agreements are being pursued to facilitate trade and investment flows. The geopolitical landscape plays a significant role in Europe's rush into Africa. With the rise of global powers like China and the increasing influence of other regions, Europe is positioning itself to maintain and expand its geopolitical relevance. Africa, with its growing economic and strategic importance, provides a battleground for influence and partnerships. Security and migration concerns have also driven Europe's interest in Africa. Instability in certain African regions has direct implications for Europe's security, as seen in issues such as terrorism and the proliferation of organized crime. By actively engaging with African nations, Europe aims to address security challenges at their source and manage migration flows more effectively. European countries are recognizing the importance of sustainable development partnerships with Africa. Instead of pursuing purely exploitative economic relationships, there is a growing emphasis on developmental aid, capacity building, and mutually beneficial collaborations. European nations are investing in education, healthcare, and infrastructure projects to contribute to Africa's long-term development. The rapid advancement of technology is another driver behind Europe's interest in Africa. European countries, home to some of the world's leading technology companies, see opportunities to collaborate with African nations on digitalization, innovation, and technology transfer. This collaboration not only benefits Africa's technological advancement but also enhances Europe's global competitiveness. The impact of climate change is a global challenge that requires collective efforts. Europe, committed to addressing climate issues, recognizes the importance of partnering with African nations to tackle environmental challenges. Investments in renewable energy, sustainable agriculture, and climate adaptation projects are part of the shared agenda between Europe and Africa. Beyond economic and geopolitical interests, there is a growing emphasis on cultural and educational exchanges. European countries are investing in programs that foster understanding, dialogue, and collaboration between the people of Europe and Africa. This cultural exchange aims to build bridges, break down stereotypes, and create a foundation for stronger diplomatic ties. However, Europe's rush into Africa is not without challenges and criticisms. Concerns about neocolonialism, unequal power dynamics, and potential exploitation of resources persist. African nations are rightfully cautious about ensuring that partnerships are equitable and mutually beneficial. Europe must approach this renewed engagement with a genuine commitment to respect the sovereignty and development aspirations of African countries. As we conclude this exploration into why Europe is rushing into Africa once again, it is clear that the dynamics between these two continents are evolving rapidly. The renewed interest from Europe can be seen as an opportunity for collaboration, mutual growth, and development. 
However, it is crucial to approach this relationship with caution, ensuring that it is built on principles of equity, sustainability, and respect for African sovereignty. Please subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell to stay connected. We value your opinions and insights, so please share your thoughts in the comments section below. Together, let's navigate the evolving dynamics between Europe and Africa and strive for a mutually beneficial future.